Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and keep watching more details. Coronation Street's Lucy Fallon confirms Bethany finds serial killer Stevens rampage hilarious in bizarre development while Bethany Platt, Lucy Fallon, has been away from Coronation Street pursuing a journalism career in London a lot has been going on in Weatherfield. Bethany's return to the street in the new year means she has to get up to speed with a lot of things very quickly Bethany left after falling for Daniel Osborne, Rob Mallard, but realizing that he wasn't ready to move on after the death of his wife Sinead, Katie McGlynn. Since then Daniel has become engaged to Daisy Midgley, Charlotte Jordan, but that relationship is currently in question after Daisy admitted to feelings for Ryan Connor, Ryan Prescott, who she slept with. Since then Daniel has become engaged to Daisy Midgley, Charlotte Jordan, but that relationship is currently in question after Daisy admitted to feelings for Ryan Connor, Ryan Prescott, who she slept with. Because Daisy is a strong female character and Bethany is also a strong female character, I feel like they're going to clash. And also, obviously, they both want the same thing. And I think there's going to be a bit of a power battle between them both. Because Daisy is a strong female character and Bethany is also a strong female character, I feel like they're going to clash. And also, obviously, they both want the same thing. And I think there's going to be a bit of a power battle between them both. Until that happens, Lucy has been enjoying playing Bethany's feistier side again as she clashes with Daisy. It's been really fun doing the scenes, because it's a different sort of side to Bethany, Lucy told us. She was super feisty when she came back in 2015. But then, obviously, with everything that happened, it kind of got rid of that side to her. And I think she's come back and that side has very much come out again with Daisy. So it's been really fun having those scenes with Charlie, and just basically being bitchy to each other. But I'm hoping that they'll make them mates again, because I actually like Charlie, and we are friends. Of course another thing that Bethany missed, which was huge for the entire Platt family, was the revelation that great-uncle Stephen Reed, Todd Boyce, was a multiple murderer who'd stolen all the factory money, killed three people, broken Audrey, Sue Nichols, S. Hart and left Tim Metcalf, Joe Dettin, for dead, before being killed himself after being hit by a car driven by Peter Barlow, Chris Gascoigne. Of course another thing that Bethany missed, which was huge for the entire Platt family, was the revelation that great-uncle Stephen Reed, Todd Boyce, was a multiple murderer who'd stolen all the factory money, killed three people, broken Audrey, Sue Nichols, S. Hart and left Tim Metcalf, Joe Dettin, for dead, before being killed himself after being hit by a car driven by Peter Barlow, Chris Gascoigne. She actually makes a couple of jokes about it, which is very insensitive, Lucy revealed. She sort of jokes that she was going to write a piece on this family drama but Gail, Helen Worth, is not very impressed by that. Bethany clearly thinks it's hilarious. Looking ahead, Lucy said she hoped for drama in the months to come for Bethany. I'd like to see her and Daisy become friends. I'd like to see her pursue her journalism career and for it all to like, work out. But then I do want that to be some drama. I don't know what drama I want that to be, but I hope that there is some. This could be tied up with whatever she was getting up to in London, as the actress teased that Bethany has a few skeletons in her cupboard from her time in the capital. She's basically been forced to come back. There is something that has happened in London that has kind of forced her to come back, but she's not revealing that straight away. She's being a bit secretive about why she has come back.